Fritzing is an excellent way to create an image of your breadboard and circuit setup. Click on breadboard. You can zoom in and out using the buttons below. Start by adding the Arduino board that you are using. In our case, it's going to be the Uno. You can rotate objects using the button here. You can also move objects. Let's start by adding an LED and resistor. You can change the color of your LED over here. You can also change the value of your resistor over here. Make sure that the resistor and LED legs match up in the same row, just like they would in a regular breadboard. Now you're ready to add some wires. Simply click and drag. This one is going to go to ground. Let's change the color to black since that's the conventional color for ground. You can also create bends in your wire to make it look nicer. Don't forget to add a wire to a digital pin. And let's change this wire color to match our LED, which is going to be green. And now you have your basic LED circuit. Also notice the bent leg here is the positive side of the LED. Now let's add a sensor. If you come over here, you can see that there are many other objects you can drag over, such as LCD screens, speakers, and even motors. Anything you don't want, you can simply click on and delete. After searching around, we find a photo sensor. Let's bring that over here. If you hover over the object, it does tell you what it is. Uh, let's go back and also add another resistor here. You can even click on an object and copy paste it if you simply want more of that same object. So let's change this one to a 10K resistor. and then add some wires here. Let's move it down. Add the ground wire, change that to black, and then add a power wire. That's something we didn't have before. We're gonna change that to red. That means we need a power wire here also connected to five volts. And finally, we're going to need the analog. And let's change that to yellow. We now have a complete breadboard with both the photosensor circuit setup and the LED circuit setup.